it's your girl, Rockstar Rochelle, your virtual 31 consultant. If you're new here, hi, my name is Rochelle and I am a consultant with 31 Gifts. And welcome to another episode of Battle of the Bag Babes. Every Tuesday, I go live and showcase you girls, you girls are the star and you're showing me your favorite 31 items and how you use it and how you work with it. And today's topic is going to be gift ideas with 31 items. So it's kind of pretty much general. And again, it's to help you gain ideas and, and get inspired, spark something in there for the holiday season. I love, I am loving this series. So we have four contestants today and I can't wait to see what the girls are going to be showing us. If you're back for another video, let me know that you're in the comments, girls, and I'll give you a shout out. And as always, my little um, assistant here is saying, don't forget to like the video. <laughs> if you love what you see, consider subscribing because we're going to be doing a ton of fun things in December because you girls know December is uh, in the holiday season is here. But uh, we're, we're going to do Major Bang uh, next month. I do want to take a note. If you have seen my video yesterday regarding the card exchange you girls were having questions like do we sign it do we leave you blank there's no pressure to fill it but if you sign it that would be awesome maybe say with love from rochelle all the way from california or sending you happy holidays and good vibes for the upcoming year from rochelle all the way from california just something fun but it's not no pressure okay i had a lot of questions okay so again let's go ahead and go on with the battle again it's to help you showcase some of the items in this catalog and and how you can use them as gifting ideas. All right, let's see who is here. Uh, Callie, what's up, Callie? I see Erin. Um, Erin, there's Carla from Pennsylvania. Kathy, Susan, what's up, Susan? You'll see be seeing more of her in a couple minutes. Also, Erin's here. You'll be seeing her again. Christy and Christine. Hello, Annette. Hello, and Danny. Welcome back from Florida. All right, girls, I always forget the banners, okay? There's a battle of the bag, babe. Again, share ideas. The goal is to share the ideas and uh to have fun amanda watching from work amanda from uh, uh uh amber from new york what's up sonia hello you must be on call are you on call right now um amanda and again this week's product spotlight is again to showcase the 31 items so let's go ahead and see who is up first up first is a new girl on on battle of the bag babe she is all the way from canada her name is jules so let's give it up for jules for her debut here on battle of the bag babe if you're loving what she's, you're seeing don't forget to comment uh number one or number two you know jules or comment number one all right so let's go ahead and have jules take it away Hey, bag babes, Julie coming to you from Canada. Um, just uh, wanting to make a video uh, featuring a gift idea that I am going to be using for this Christmas. I have to be quiet so my kids don't hear me. Anyhow, um, what I would like to feature today is the Clip and Zip Wallet. Um, my gift idea for this product is um, that I will be, um, I, I have to buy for a few teenagers this year, some nieces and my oldest daughter. And my idea was to gift them a nice cozy sweater uh, with a pouch in the front, which would include a wallet, uh, the clip and zip wallet uh, with a gift card inside, like a Starbucks card or something like that. So of course you've got the uh, slot for the ID and I have for myself, this is my wallet, um, three cards here, three cards here as well. Um, I don't really use personally this other than for receipts. Um, and then of course the change purse was just quite large. I actually just put a few more cards in here because I rarely carry change around. So I've got my kids' health cards in there as well. I love the canvas, uh, the canvas material. And I really like the other color. I love this khaki color and I love the denim color that it comes in. I love how my keys can attach here, no problem. And I've got them really easily available. And this is my great gift idea, um, is the cozy sweater with a hidden wallet inside with a gift card. I hope you like my idea and uh, have a great day. Pick me. Great job, Jules. What do you think? Way to go for her first uh, entry. I, I think I like it. She, it's a C theme. A C theme. Clip and zip. Cozy sweater. Card. Gift card, right? <laughs> Super easy to remember. Um, again, these items, I will try to come uh, link them all down below so you girls can quickly, you know, get to them. All right. So next up, 
we have, I love it. Jules is in the, she's in there. She's like, I love it. Pick P number one. Hi, Jewel. That's me. <laughs> Great idea, Jules. All right. Up next. See, this is Susan. Now she's not new to the Battle of the Back Babes, but we always love what she has to share. She created the B Jammin for that Benjamins. I love that. So now I'm using it B Jammins all the time. So Susan, all the way from Illinois, let's go ahead and share my screen and let's see what her gifting ideas is all about. And here we go. Hey, bag babes. I am so excited and I hope my family and friends are not watching because some of these things that I've put together are actually their gifts for Christmas and some upcoming birthdays. But I do want to start out first because I like the personalization on this one. It's the summer carryall caddy and it's got Manny and Petty on it because we can't go get those little pamperings done anymore. Um, so I've put this together and it's got some files in it. I've got two of the rounds with some things that they can use in case you know they want to take polish off or they make a mistake got some nail polish in here some cuticle cream and then I like this because it's got the nifty little pouches on the outside that you can stick things for pedicures and some cream and some remover Okay, so that's that's just one idea. And this also fits into the felt hanging bin, and you could also do the personalization there, or a zipper pouch. And this is just the regular, not the mini zipper pouch that you could um, do the personalization. Um, a carry-all caddy, okay? And I know these are super functional. Again, this is for a birthday for a niece that's coming up. And again, the little pouch that um, you can stick things, cards, um, little toys fit in here. Um, I even got her one of the children's masks with personalization. So I hope she really likes this little carry-all caddy. And again, all of that would fit if you wanted to personalize this. Um, hanging felt bin. But speaking of felt, I am a fan of felt. So I have the wine gift bag, which is perfect. And you can get that personalized. It fits um, a bottle of any kind of drink that you want and a card. You don't even have to wrap it. It's ready to go. My niece just bought a house. Great housewarming gift. Her last name is H. And so this is the uh, tiny utility tote with one of the other felt wine bag in the graphic. Um, also, I have one a carry-all caddy in here. And inside of it, it's got a couple of little um, wine tumblers and a snack. And then again, on the side, we have, um, you know, a wine cork in case you don't drink it all. An aerator will fit in there. And I have a wine opener. And that's perfectly inside this tote with some cocktail napkins. So there you go. Also, housewarming, okay, for her new home, the felt display bin. And it's got all kinds of goodies that she's going to need. Toilet paper, paper towels, Kleenex, all that stuff with a cute personalization. All right, well, I hope I have thousands of more. I, well, maybe not thousands, but a few more ideas. Hope you like them. Thanks, Susan. I think that was great. Um, wherever those uh, drinking wine bottles go, I'd like to be there too. Am I? <laughs> I love the wine tumbler. That is such a great idea. Way to go, Susan. Yes, you do have the presents. Okay. You did an amazing job. So thank you, Susan. If you're loving her presentation, vote number two. Okay. Now, another newbie, this girl, uh, her name is Carmen. She is representing North Carolina. So she is, again, a new girl on Battle of the Bag Babe. So let's hear what she has to say or her gifting ideas with any of the 31 items. Here we go. Hi, everyone, friends. I'd like to share with you some ideas for shopping. And the first idea I have is the timeless memory pouches that are for $4.50. I thought if you would like to reach your $50 goal of to get something half off, you could buy 12 of these. So that means you could have 24 friends to be able to um, give them a little gift. And so what I thought that could go in there is 
uh, some brownie cupcakes. I don't know if you've ever heard of that. It's kind of like you're, you make cupcakes, but you put um, the same kind of brownie mix, the food core in a 9 by 13 pan. You would just pour them about two-thirds full and let them bake, and, and then um, you can put them in Ziploc bags and put them in the timeless memory pouches. So I thought that would be fun. All right. And then the next idea that I have is a zipper pouch. Okay, thank you. I thought this would be a great gift for a, a friend. So let's say like if you spent $50, and then you can get this half off. So it's a $16 item, so it would be $8. And I thought for a friend, you could get monogrammed, because monogramming is, would be half off too. And so I have an idea for um, the BDS. If you have a friend that is in charge of BDS, I love the little monogram that says I love, so you can fill the blank, it could be BDS or anything else. And the llama bag. All right. um, happy National Collection Week if you're packing shoe boxes this week. I love that 31 has a llama, and so I did alpaca shoe box. So I thought that would be fun. That could go on a timeless llama. A zipper pouch. So for $13, I thought that would be a great gift for somebody. Also, there is a mini zipper pouch that's on sale for $10.50. That's in the navy and wide stripe pattern. And what I do is I put a little cross stitch kit in here so it's ready to go at all times. So if you have a friend that likes to cross stitch, you can get these little kits for like a dollar. So for about $11, that would be a wonderful gift. All right, the little brain, little carry-all cutty. Thank you. I'm not a consultant, but um, when I have parties with my consultant, she has given me one of these. And I know I've heard a lot of you say that it's fun to put your, your junk that you have that goes on the on your dresser, that keep it clean. That's what I keep mine for now. I love it. Okay, and now the snow globe. Also, a great gift idea. These are my favorite bags. So this one is called Snow Globe, and it's on sale for $24. And my favorite pattern is the football one. So if you have any football friends or a football mom or a cheerleading mom, um, I love this football pattern, and it is called Touchdown Time, and it's on sale for $28.50. And I think it's so cute, but the score is $31. Okay. And then the next one. Another, another bag that I love is the essential storage tote. And you can pick any two for $52, and I thought that would be a great gift. Thank you. Thank you, Carmen, for all those gifty ideas. Uh, way to go to your assistants for getting in on there. Um, thank you to my little assistant right here for doodling on the side. But I think one thing that I've gained personally is uh, brownie cupcakes. I'm going to have to try that next time. So, again, you're getting all the love in the comment section. Great, great, great ideas, Carmen. Very creative. Awesome. Wilder's Carmen, loads of ideas, right? Okay, now last bag, babe is Erin. She is also new to the Battle of the Bag Babe. So this is what Erin has to say about or what her ideas in terms of the, how she would gift uh, using 31. So let's go ahead and have Erin take it away. Hi, Bag Babes. My name is Erin and I am a crafter. And the way I like to give my Christmas gifts is to turn them into gift baskets. So here you'll see that I took the food truck large utility tote and put in some items as far as a dish pan, some food, a towel, a little uh, scrubby, an apron, a hat, and there's also some pots and pans and utensils in there. Um, for the new parents or a new baby in the family, you can take the zip top organizing tote and fill it with a bunch of goodies. Um, over here you have the barn large utility tote for the little boy from your family. Fill it with tractors and farm animals and whatever else you can find. I also have pictures of some of the older ones that I've done. Here you'll see that I took the little carry-all caddy. Um, the little carry-all caddy had frogs on it. So I got a frog bath mitt, a frog loofah, and a frog 
uh, washcloth and also added um, body wash and shampoo and bubble bath to it and gave that away. Uh, this is for the working person in your family um, or someone going back to school. And that goes with the one next. I took the train and made a Polar Express gift basket. There's a blanket, some mugs, some marshmallows with hot chocolate, some cookie mix, the Polar Express movie, the Believe um, Bell, and a bunch of other goodies in there. So those are just a few ideas of how I give my Christmas gifts. Thank you. Ladies, I'm blown away. You girls are like, the ideas that are coming out are just amazing. You girls are great with putting like little sets and themes together. That's what the whole purpose of Battle of the Bag Blaze is. So if you love whichever presentation, number one, number two, number three, number four, or, um, comment their name down below or simply put the number. I will announce the winner on Saturday's Battle of Bag Babe TV, okay? <laughs> I got 21 girls watching me. So girls, thank you so much. Don't forget to give this video a big like. I know it's a, a late Tuesday evening and I, I would like to make these lives short because, you know, dinner's got to get going or you're getting ready for bed. Okay. So Erin, Amanda, everybody is giving you some shout outs. Good job, ladies. Hi, Casey. How are you? Um, uh, Sonia, Jules, I want to say Amanda, I want to say everybody. I gave a shout out to, I think Tar Tara, I think I saw you, Tara, Mary Jane, welcome. All right, girls, again, uh, if you just in case you missed it um, with the cards from my yes from yesterday's video, I, I, I contacted uh, my parish. You can you can it's up to you. You can um, write write a little nice note to it, um, but it's not mandatory. And um, if you don't, then I'll, I'll fill it out. You know, I'll, I'll, I'll leave some happy vibes out their way or I can have the kids doodle in there. That's always fun, too. Again, thank you girls so much for uh, hanging in with me on your Tuesday evening. And I hope you're enjoying the holiday sale. There are about 40 items added to that list and there um, and it's while supplies less. I wanted to say that. All right. <laughs> if you want to be on an upcoming battle, uh, we're just going to go on with the same theme because you girls are great with this. And again, it's we'll probably do this for all of November. Uh, so you girls, if you want to plan ahead and give you, you simply have to give me email via email or text a two to three minute video on how you would use 31 as a gifting idea, whether it be the holidays or like Aaron during baby showers or Susan and Aaron like a homecoming gift. I'm not homecoming. Um, house, house, house warming gift. Yeah, that's what I wanted to say. Uh, or you can join me live Tuesday at five eight, at five p.m. East West Coast time, eight p.m. East Coast time. Okay, um, and just comment down below me or contact me. That's how you can get in on next Tuesday's Battle of the Back, babe. All right, ladies, you have a wonderful, blessed evening. Again, give this video a big like. This is courtesy of my assistant right here, who's drawing all over my thirty-one boxes right now. And um, if you haven't yet subscribed, all right, ladies, take care. I'll see you. Bye.